بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين It is the martyrdom of Imam Ali alayhi salam I send you my deepest condolences to all the Muslims in the world When we talk about Imam Ali alayhi salam we understand that he is absolutely great The greater a person is the more of the ability they have to attract the stronger a person is the more they will attract the adhumat of imam ali alayhi salam is so great that many scholars regardless of what madhab or sect they have they were attracted to ali ibn abi talib many of them wrote different books about the life of imam ali alayhi salam so we understand that this feeling we have about imam ali alayhi salam it's due to his greatness There's a tradition that says la ahabbani jabalun la tahafat If a mountain were to love me it would be destroyed Why because Imam Ali alayhi salam is so great according to this interpretation that the greatness of Amir al-Mu'minin his hope his love is so great it would cause mountains to melt And this is due to his connection to God as we said Why is Imam Ali alayhi salam so great in our eyes? Because he is connected, he has such a strong connection to God. When human beings worship God truly, they become great. We look in this tradition that talks about Imam Ali alayhi salam and says that if you were to put all of faith in all of creation on one side and then you would put the faith of Ali ibn Abi Talib on the other side, the side of Amir al-Mu'mineen what outweighed the other side of all of creation this means that his connection to god is the cause of his azamat is the cause of his greatness it means that imam ali alayhi salam has this beauty beautiful way of allowing us to be guided to that he can pull us up that he can grab our hands his stories his hadith his nahj al balagha has guided us This scholar by the name of George Dordaq he is a Christian a Lebanese author that wrote about Imam Ali alayhi salam that he used to run away from school he says and would go to somewhere next to the river and would read Nahj al Balagha the speech and the letters of Imam Ali alayhi salam the sayings of Imam Ali he became in love with Imam Ali so much that say and he would say that if God were take it, to put take away all our blessings to take away whatever he had given us but instead were to give us one more ali ibn abi talib it would be worth it this is the love of ali mu'minin that it transcends it's timeless it doesn't it's not only limited to followers of the ahlul bayt it's for everybody why because of his azamat because of his greatness his greatness pulls in us and he guides us Imam Ali alayhi salam throughout his life he guided us because of his azamat and his connection to God. Also after he has passed away in the hereafter he guides us and saves us because one of the meanings of guidance means to it means isal ila al-matlub it means taking to what is desired. In this tradition that I'll read for you Imam Ali alayhi salam the messenger of Allah asked Jibril how will his nation pass the narrow bridge because the messenger of god was worried about how people would pass sarat the narrow bridge and jibril says god sends him your salams and says surely you will pass with my light that the messenger of god will pass with the light of god and that ali ibn abi talib will pass the sarat with your light that with the light of rasulullah imam ali will pass the sarat but your nation will pass the bridge with the light of ali the nation of prophet muhammad will pass through the light of imam ali by the sarat the light of your nation is from the light of ali the nur that your umma has is from the light of ali and the light of ali is from your light imam, imam ali's light is from prophet muhammad and your light is from the light of god then he says this sentence which is showing us the greatness of ali ibn abi talib likull shay'in jawaz in everything there is a permission 
while Jawaz of Sarat and the permission to pass the Sarat, the narrow bridge which under it is hell, Hubba Ali ibn Abi Talib is the love of Amir al Mu'minin Ali ibn Abi Talib. So the more we love Ali ibn Abi Talib, the more that we will have a good life in this world, and the more of a chance there is that we will pass through the Sarat and enter heaven. May we, inshallah, keep each and every one of us in prayers in this holy day, and may we, inshallah, increase in our love of Ali ibn Abi Talib, alayhi salam.